Hi, this is John Morgan with the latest video tip for 2020 design. So you'll see right now I have a perspective. I want to save this as a view. If we go down to the very bottom down here, there's a little space that here has an arrow next to it. If I click there, I can call this living space and click save. I can then turn my image and say I want to look back and get a full kitchen view. Well, I can come down to that space at the bottom and type in full kitchen. I can hit save. I can then zoom in and I want to get a quick look back over the island. So we'll come in here and say island. We'll click save view. Say I'm going to look back, you know, back towards the living space. I'm just going to call this uh, sink wall. So I'm just giving these names. If I click this arrow here, it actually gives me all these different save views. Sink wall, island, full kitchen, living space. If I closed out of this rendering, anytime I want, I can go up the presentation while I'm working. Maybe I'm presenting it to a customer. I can click on this arrow and say, hey, you know what? Let's take a look at the living space. So it'll load the rendering as that vantage point. It also saves it so when I want to show multiple renderings on a single piece of paper, I have multiple views and I can copy two, three, four on one large piece of paper and show people different perspectives of their kitchen in my presentation. All because I went to the bottom and I hit save. For other great ideas, tips, and inspiration, please join us at 2020spaces.com forward slash community.